a really simple idea from one of my colleagues, uh, the former um, head of the uh, Office of National Statistics in the UK, was that we as statistical offices have a duty to be helpful. And I think that very simple phrase, uh, it's, a, it's nothing new, it's a reminder uh, as public servants, uh, is something that has stuck with me. Uh, and I think that's opened up a whole set of possibilities our expertise to create greater value uh, for our population. There are a number of things that um, uh, we are doing in Canada uh, that I think uh, uh, are, are worthy uh, and are being shared, by the way. So I, I wouldn't say it's a, it's a secret. Um, and, and in many cases, we do some things and then somebody takes it to the next step. Um, but I think the, uh, the range of, uh, of, of innovative um, uh, tools, techniques that we have put in place, whether it's uh, crowdsourcing, whether it's you know, scanner data, whether uh, it, it is... Uh, you know, the partnership models that, that, that we put in place. Uh, I think these are all um, uh, uh, inspirational in many sense to the overall statistical community. The use of data science and machine learning and artificial intelligence to bring greater value efficiencies, et cetera. Um, these are the kinds of things that we are sharing. Um, uh, the, the, the work that we're doing under the high level group on the modernization of official statistics um, uh, to, to focus on things like input privacy and how do you... Um, move the whole necessity and, uh, and proportionality framework uh, in the context of privacy. These are areas in which we, I think Statistics Canada is punching well above its weight uh, and sharing the lessons that we've learned with the international community. Uh, and again, it's a team sport. So just as we give, we get something back. Uh, and I uh, continue to look forward to learning and contributing with my colleagues. Yeah, I, I, look, I think we need to create both um, uh, um, informal fora uh, where, you know, initiatives should be taken by uh, leaders to, to bring disciplines together at all levels. Uh, this new, uh, the, one of the things of the pandemic it's shown is that you don't need to get on a plane and you don't need to go through hotels and things like that. So I, and, and, and have to worry about things like, you know, budgets and so on. Uh, I think it's opened up a whole new uh, uh, possibility um, uh, may not be ideal, but it's certainly, I think, bringing, you know, people, ideas, technologies together. Uh, and I certainly look forward to uh, those interactions and those networks uh, continuing. And um, secondly, I, 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 you know, I think we are genuinely playing a leadership role in making sure that the systems that exist, the formal systems that exist, are, in fact, more efficient and more effective uh, by bringing this current context uh, and demonstrating the need for change, uh, where we need to be more agile, more responsive, uh, quicker on the draw, um, and can't take uh, you know months and years to to to, to bring in new standards and systems. So um, so I think you know leadership uh, is important. Uh, uh, it's capitalizing in a sense on a bit of the crisis that we've got, but for good reasons and altruistic reasons. Oh, I, I think, um, uh, you know, one is just simply meeting up with the demands, uh, the demands of the policymaker, of our citizens, of our businesses, uh, our nonprofit organizations for more data, quicker data. Uh, I think that demand is is going to continue to, to grow the need for integrated data. So it's not just about the what, but the so what now what um, I think they're looking for statistical offices to, 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 to be able to provide greater value. I think they're, you know, the, the demand for um, uh, us to play leadership roles and, and stewards of data. How do we bring different pieces of information, uh, use it responsibly uh, and, and, and provide that value to citizens? Um, I think these are the kinds of demands that are being placed on uh, uh, statistical organizations. And by and large, I believe the statistical community is rising uh, to that challenge. And it's a really exciting era because there's a, uh, a revolution of using new tools and techniques uh, to engage our citizens and to be engaging uh, with our policymakers, both at the domestic and the international level. Uh, there, are, there are a few that come to mind, but it's a book that I, I, I reread, uh, and it's The Black Swan. Uh, it's, uh, it, it talks about 
uh, uh, you know, these once in a, a lifetime events, which changes everything. Um, so I certainly have uh, enjoyed rereading that book uh, and changing and challenging some of my assumptions about, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, what are those faint signals um, that can, in fact, uh, change everything.